Hey guys, hope you are well. So before I start, which is um, Mark 16 verse 18, um, it talks basically about the believers and the non-believers towards the end of times. And um, what will happen is many will believe Christ when they see him and many will not. They'll think it's bogus or hoax, whatever it is. But here, this is what it says. Whoever believes and is baptized will be saved but whoever does not believe will be condemned so this is what it says and and the signs will accompany those who believe in my name they will drive out demons they will speak in new tongues they will pick up snakes with their hands and when they drink poison it will not hurt them at all they will place their hands on sick people and they will get well. Crazy, right? I was like, wow. So basically, this is what it means is if harm were to come our way, we're still protected. If people try to hurt us, we're still protected. God will transform it. And so it's saying it is not the water of baptism that saves but God's grace okay but I want to go over this here at times God intervenes miraculously see to protect his followers so we have nothing to fear even if there's fire next to us we have nothing to fear even if people come against us we have nothing to fear there is nothing to fear if we have faith and look what he says here occasionally he gives them special power Believers have special power that is within them, that is unlocked, that they need to tap into. If you are tapped within, you can unlock this. L listen to this. Paul handled a snake safely in Acts 20 verse 5. And the disciples healed the sick. This does not mean, however, that we should test God. Okay? So... Everybody has this within them. It's just about knowing what it is and finding out what it is. If you are a true believer. That's all I'm going to say. Have a good night.